Welcome to the video review on the Heritage 01 and Heritage 02. Bathroom cabinets characterized by a unique slatted base as well as a sleek white top in better curl. The cabinets are wall mounted and both of them come with two mirror options and I'll talk about these more later. First, let's take a closer look at the Heritage 01 bathroom unit. Now the Heritage 01 is equipped with drawers both on the sides as well as in the middle under the basin and this one is quite a lot bigger than the side ones. Furthermore, the Heritage 01 is available with two options of stunning mirrors above it and I will talk about these a bit more later. The fact that the inner drawer is concealed gives the unit a clean appearance when viewed from outside. This allows us to focus on the unique alternating effect created by the Canaletto walnut wood slats. These slats are manually accurately applied onto layered wood panels by skilled craftsmen. The Heritage 01 is highly adjustable in width. You can choose exactly how long you want the unit to be, with the minimum length being at 107 centimeters and a maximum of 145 centimeters. So you can really customize it down to the last centimeter. The front and side of the Heritage 01 bathroom unit are finished with solid Canaletto walnut wood slats, and these create an alternating positive negative effect. However, these panels can also be made in a matte lacquered finish, available in a range of colors. Above the sleek white better curl top of the unit, one has the option of two different mirrors. Now here we have the option of the entirely glass mirror, which is equipped with an LED light at the top and then lighting behind it on the remaining three sides, as well as this clear shelf. However, the other mirror option includes a frame around the mirror in the exact same finish as the shell of the unit and then backlighting on all of the four sides. Now let's take a look at Heritage 01 sibling, the Heritage 02. The Heritage 02 consists of wall mounted baskets with a slatted front and the bottom part has the baskets while the top part, which perfectly matches the front of these baskets, is a fixed finish. The lower part of the base units, as I mentioned, contains the large basket, while the upper part is fixed. And both of these units form a horizontal band, allowing for the opening of the basket, which, as we saw in the Heritage 01, has a nice concealed finish. Just like we saw in the Heritage 01, the length of the Heritage 02 can also be customized according to you down to the last centimeter. The minimum length that you can choose is 120 centimeters, while the maximum is all the way up to 200 centimeters for a larger unit. The fronts of the unit are matte lacquered MDF wood, available in all of the colors on the roll and second scales. They are characterized by these unique grooves which are created by machine milling. These also create that positive negative alternating effect. Just as we saw in the Heritage 01, its sibling unit, the Heritage 02, comes with a mirror above the sleek unit, available in two different versions. This particular mirror here is the option with the frame that matches the slatted fronts and sides of the unit itself, which comes with backlighting behind all four sides of the mirror. The other mirror option, as we saw in the Heritage 01, is that in, in entirely in glass with the spotlight above it and the backlighting on all three remaining sides. Furthermore, that mirror, as you may remember, includes the glass shelf. The Heritage 02 also comes with an optional dressing table and the front of this dressing table is finished in the exact same slatted look as the unit itself. It perfectly aligns with the unit for a clean finish. This has been the video review on the sleek bathroom cabinets Heritage 01 and Heritage 02. Let us know in the comments which unit you prefer and which mirror you would choose to pair with it. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like and subscribe to see more product reviews. 
click the bell notification to be notified about any new videos. Thank you for watching.